let's talk about funding your growth. One of the benefits and of Innovate UK funding is the IP is yours. I think a big part of perhaps looking at this in terms of private versus public is the longer term objective. A lot of the Innovate UK funding isn't one to one, it's one to many. The value of that one to many is you are building relationships for the future. UKRI more broadly can be funding academic led. So there can be an advantage to industry to collaborate in academic led uh, collaboration. Growth doesn't have to mean profit. And I think it's finding your fit specific to your concept or your idea or your product. The UKRI give very good feedback when you're not successful and usually you get to see reviewers comments uh, and I would say that that's a really good guide to you to say, should I try again? How important is the team behind you? The team of your consortium can be hugely insightful to Innovate UK in terms of the richness of that, that programme. As I've founded and grown businesses, I have gone to people and asked for help when I've not had any money to pay them. And I've been amazed at how much people will help you. My absolute, absolute top tip is get somebody in marketing and communications to read your submission. Read the guidance and use it as your, almost your script. When you've had that stamp of approval and it goes into IP talk, it can get very messy. And then all of that effort that you've put in, it's just gone down the drain if you don't come to an agreement. So it's worth watching on just to see. Fantastic.